Hello guys, welcome back to the channel. Uh, this is the second part of IGCSC uh, paper from October November 2023. In the first video we did question 1 to 13, in this video we will do remaining questions. So before we start I would request you guys if you are new to the channel and you are getting benefit from my videos, kindly subscribe to the channel and share it with your friends and also press the like button. So let's start. First one, uh, question 14, factorize completely. First of all, whenever you factorize, you look at the numbers 40 to 35. Both are multiples of 7. So that means 7 is common, right? Then M, we have M common here. There is nothing else here. So when you do this 7 times 6, 7 times 6 is 42. So 7 is out, inside we are left with the 6, right? m is gone then we have k here minus similarly 35 is 7 times 5 so 7 is out so we have 5 inside the bracket so even then when you once you do you see if there is anything else uh, remaining which is common so you can take out in the second step so final answer is 7m 6k minus 5 right now find hcf of 140 and 126 so the easiest way to find out hcf <coughs> the division method so take a number prime number here that divides both of them so both are even number both are divisible by 2 to 2 times 7 2 times 6 2 times 3 now this is even this is odd so it is not divided by uh, divisible by 2 uh, none of uh, like this one is divided by divided by 3 but this cannot be so i can see this is divisible by 7 so 10 and 9 so there is no another number that can divide both 10 and 9 together so our hcf is 2 times 7 which is 14. Now, number 16, simplify n power 5 times n. So, as you know by the uh, rules of exponents, x power m, when we have multiplication sign inside, when we add the powers. So, x plus m. So, this is the rule that we are going to use. So, this is n 5 plus. If there is nothing, that means there is a 1. So, n power 6 right now this is 8 x 6 divided by 2 x squared 2 times 4 so this is cancelled uh, 4 then x now this is division rule when there is a division sign here then we divide the power uh, subtract the powers m minus n m which is 6 minus 2 so 4 x power 4 is the final answer now number 17 the circumference of the circle is 59 uh, centimeters calculate the radius now we know the formula of circumference circumference of the circle is 2 pi r so circumference is given to us 59 so 2 pi r is equal to 59 and r is going to be 59 divided by 2 pi Okay, so once you calculate this with the calculator, it comes out to be 9.388. So approximately 9.39 to 3 significant figures. Remember to write your answer to the 3 significant figure. <coughs> Question number 18. Uh, by writing each number in the calculation correct to one significant figure find an estimate for the value of, of this one uh, you must show all your working now you see the common mistake students they do uh, they first calculate it then they are going to do this uh, the what you call estimation but here whenever we have to estimate first by writing each number so we are writing this each number by uh, two significant uh, one significant figure so 36.9 to one significant figure is going to be 40 and 24 is going to be 20 38 is going to be 4 minus 1 so this is 60 
over 3 answer is 20. So, final answer is 20. Now, Indira invests dollar uh, 6000 at rate of R percent per year simple interest. At the end of 4 year, the value of her investment is uh, 6840. Find the value of R. Now, this is a principal amount and this is amount after the interest is uh, put on this. So, what will be the interest? So, interest that we are having here is uh, 6840 minus 6000 meaning it is uh, 840 dollars right. So, that is the simple interest. Now, we have the formula simple interest is P R T over 100. So, this simple interest is given to us 840 principal amount is 6000 from here r we do not know time we have 4 years over 100 right. So, we are just going to simplify these two zeros are gone. Uh, so, we have 840 equals to 60 times 4 times r. So, divide by 60 times 4 divide by 60 times 4. So, this and this is gone. So, once you calculate this, this comes out to be 3.5, okay. <clears throat> that is the percentage of the rate of interest. So, now let us see the next question that we have here is number 20. Uh, find the area of the trapezium. You can see a trapezium there, there is a trapezium. Um, this two parallel lines one is 14 another one is 8 and height is also given. So, it is very simple we are just going to write down the formula the area of trapezium you all know that half a plus b times height. So, half a a is 14 b is 8 times height is 6 this is the height. So, 1 over 2 times this is 22 times 6, 2 times 3. So, this is 66, 66 centimeters squared. Very simple question. Now, next one number 21. Write these numbers in standard form. In standard form 4000, uh, 45000. So, in standard form over number, this number should be uh, like between 0 and 9. So, 4.5 10 raised to power. So, decimal is here 1, 2, 3, and 4. We are shifting uh, 4 uh, digits uh, left hand side so that we are going to put it positive 4. 4.5 10 raised to power 4. Here it should be 6.3 as we want to make this digit uh, between 1 and 9. So, 10 raised to power now we are shifting decimal 1, 2, 3 places towards right hand side. So, this is going to be negative 6.3 times 10 raised to power minus 3 right. Now, calculate 8.2 uh, times 10 raised to power minus 150 in the stand, uh, thousand in, write the answer in standard form. So, I can rewrite it 82 over 10, this is 1 over 10, this is 150,000, right. So, 1020, 1, 2. So, now once you calculate this one, this is 123,000. So, then 1.23 times 10 raised to power 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 10 raised to power 5. So, 1.23 10 power 5 is the final answer, right. Now, next one we have uh, the length S meters of the ship is 280 meters correct to the nearest meter. Complete the statement. So, you can see we need to have the lower bound and upper bound 287. So, for the upper bound and for the lower bound. What you need to do? So, we have 1 meter to the nearest meter. Nearest meter 1 meter half of that is 0 0.5 meters. So, we are going to add 0 0.5, we are going to subtract 0 0.5 that will make it 287 uh, 
0.5 this is 286.5 upper bound is 287.5 286.5 now number 23 uh, the table shows the number of people in a town who are left handed and the number who are right handed here we have left handed people right handed and this is total write down the probability that person chosen at random is left handed so left handed is here 8400 and total is 57000 so that's it then you calculate this you can leave your answer here or we can just divide it it is divisible by 2 so when you divide it by 2 this is 42 2 times 2 then 8 and 5 now this is divisible by uh, 8 plus 2 plus 5 13 6 by 3 14 3 times 9 3 times 5 so 14 over 95 is the answer in the simplest form okay I hope you are getting it so now please subscribe to the channel and share it with your friends it will be a great support to me guys it's a motivation to do more videos uh, number 24 change 1.2 meter square into millimeter square uh, 1.2 meter square now see it's a square here it's a square here so you need to be careful that when doing you are doing like 1 meter is equal to 100 centimeters right so 1 meter square meaning 1 times 1 so this also is going to be 100 times 100 centimeter square so 1 meter square is equal to 10,000 centimeter square so 1.2 times 100 times 100 that is meter but we are looking for the uh, sorry meter to centimeter then from meter this is meter and then we have from centimeter so 1 centimeter is equal to 10 millimeters right so then times 10 times 10 so this is the number of zeros we are going to get uh, 1.2 uh, we are not given that you are going to specify it uh, with the uh, the standard form so we can just write it down so we will have 1 2 3 4 5 6 0 1 2 3 4 5 and 6 0 this 0 is cancelled so we have 100 and uh, we will left with five zeros here yeah so that's it <coughs> sorry now part b and the speed limit on road is 80 uh, kilometer per hour so this is speed uh, sophie drive uh, sophie drives at speed of uh, 1200 meter per minute so this is in kilometer per hour this is in meter per minute show that Sophie drives at speed lower than the speed limit so speed limit 80 kilometer per hour so we can convert that the speed limit is 80 kilometers per hour so 80 kilometer times 1000 will make it a meter to compare with this and hour two minutes is going to be uh, divided by 60 right so then we can simplify let's see so this uh, 2 times 3 2 times 4 2 times 3 2 times 4 so this is 4000 over 3 so let's divide 4000 by 3 then it's 1 3 times 1 is 3 uh, then 3 times 3 is 9 uh, 1 0 3 times 3 is 9 you can use calculator I don't have this calculator right now here so I'm just doing it so it's 133.3 uh, meter per minute so this is the speed limit but she is uh, dri driving at 1200 so which is uh, which is uh, one thousand two hundred meter per minute is less than the speed limit 
is less than the speed limit which is this one okay now number 25 this is the last question of this uh, video let's do that calculate the area of the semicircle with radius 10 centimeter so area of circle is pi r squared okay semicircle is half of the circle area of semicircle is going to be half pi r squared so meaning half times pi times r is 10 squared so this is <coughs> 1 over 2 times pi times 100 this is 50 so 55 once you calculate this comes out to be 157 centimeter squared so that's it for this uh, video guys i hope you guys uh, get everything kindly subscribe to the channel and share it with your friends and also press the like button and i will wait for your comments for the feedback thank you so much guys be blessed